Hey, welcome back gamers. Hunter Gaming here. We are back on Hunting Simulator. Still in the Rocky Mountain area. There is one more hunt I want to do here. I want to do this combined elk mule deer hunt. I'll clean these other ones up after that one because I actually opened the European forest up. So I can't wait to get in here and see what this is. We got some stuff that I haven't seen, you know, in this game yet. The wild boars and some fallow deer and all. So we'll go ahead and uh, do this Rocky Mountain hunt. Unfortunately, it looks like it might run into a time frame problem since we're starting at 5. So we'll take some night gear with us and see how this works. So let's go ahead and start this up. So we know we have an elk and a mule deer. So we'll see what I have here. We'll use, uh, probably can use, I'm going to keep that one. And I'm going to keep that one there. Um, we're going to take an elk collar with us this time and night vision goggles we oh I already got them on so let's go ahead and start this off all right here we go guys claim one elk and then we're also going to do that mule deer um, at least it's not a uh, blizzard this time so let's go see this map region and well actually we're going to be right up there so let's go ahead and put the elk rifle on We'll start heading up that way. And hopefully we can catch a mule deer while we're trying to find this. Oh, we got tracks right here. Let's see what this one is. With these mountains. Beautiful. Alright. Getting sidetracked. So an elk and a mule deer. The good thing about all this snow is they're very easy to see at this point. Elk five hours heading west, so we're going to start heading down that way. We got another trail over there. So they're five hours in front of us, so we got a little bit of a walk. But maybe during this walk we can find a mule deer out there. Alright, let's see what this track here says. Elk three hours west. Uh, let's just keep on moving down here. Let's see what we got over there? Oh, we got a moose out there. Let's see what this guy says here. Two hours northwest. Still got that moose down here. Oh, what do we got over here? Another moose. So we got a lot of, a lot of moose. We're gonna fall down this hill a little bit, aren't we? What do we got? That's that moose, right? Okay, make sure nothing else is walking around before I make all this movement. Here's another track here. At this point, I'm gonna start getting into the crawl position. We got something up there. Only because I'm starting to get a little too close. And crawling is probably the best way to go. So we don't get seen here. Two hours heading west, so it's somewhat in front of us. Got that moose over there. I don't know what's behind me. Well, let's just continue. We got something there. That darn moose again. up spotting me here. Is that another moose over here? Well, this would have been an easy moose hunt. Let's see if that thing's still behind me. The moose is coming right toward me. She hasn't seen me yet. Unfortunately, then she's going to wind up getting whiff of me, and then she's going to run and scare everything else away. How close are you going to get to me? There she goes. Alright. What we got back behind me? Another moose. My goodness. Oh, 
Well, we need an elk, and we need a mule deer. Well, there's oh, there's a white tail. I'm finding everything but what I'm after. Oh, we got a. We do have an elk over here. He's coming right for me. Should be an easy shot. Up, oh, he's bedding down. We hit him. Put another shot into him. And down he goes. So we got our elk. Move this map up. Let me mark him. Because we do want to find a uh, mule deer as well. I'm going to switch to the composite rifle. And maybe we can go find ourselves a mule deer before we run out of time. All right, we'll head north on this uh, creek bed here. See if we see anything up this way. And if not, then we'll circle back and around. Got a pronghorn. My God, I'm seeing everything but what I need. Well, we're sitting on less than an hour left. Can't find a mule deer. Uh, found plenty of whitetails and elk and moose. So, I'm gonna have to go back and claim that elk before the time's up. I was hoping to be able to run into a mule deer, but I'm finding everything else out here but mule deer. So unfortunately, I'm not gonna be able to get, get this hunt done. There's our mule deer. Go ahead and track him down. Let's see if we can get a shot out of him. There he goes. We're gonna have to take a, a pop shot at him. We hit him. Or her, I mean. At least she's running in the in the area where my elk is. That was a low shot, but we got him. So we're actually going to have to hurry because we're down to a half an hour. All right, here she is. I have to run because we are almost out of time here. Claim that one. Didn't hit any vitals, but we got to we got to make a fast pace here. How much time I got? Half an hour to get up there. All right, we're almost up to the deer. You can see I got about eight minutes left. Talk about just, I mean, the elk. I don't know why I said deer, but go ahead and pick this elk up before it's too late. And we got it through the lungs, 87 yards. So that's it. We got the primary elk and mule deer out of the way. Wanted a buck, but we settled for a doe because I was finding everything but mule deer out there. So we, there was no bonus or secondary in this one. Oh, we opened a six power scope up. That's kind of cool. So now we can use that. So there you go, guys. That's the Rocky Mountains that we got that one done. I'm going to go ahead and get these wolves and the moose. You've seen that already. I'll get the two grizzly bears out of the way. I'm going to clean this section up. This way we can start this European forest. I um, hope you guys liked the video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't done so. And leave some comments down below. Thanks for watching.